Hey everybody, thanks for tuning in. I uh, appreciate you visiting this, uh, this video. Uh, I wanted to share with you this fun little discovery that I, I, I found out and uh, just walking around in Home Depot that I actually need um, uh, to use for projects. But uh, basically I needed some ra uh, a rail system, like a sliding rail system for all my projects, uh, for, well, projects that I needed in to, for applications for like cutting and drilling. So, um, so I was like I'm looking at, at all these videos and I, I, they were good and everything. And then people were just building some railing systems using like, um, bearings like, like these, these I got, I got from, uh, a friend. He was throwing some, uh, wheels away from his, uh, his kid's, uh, toy, like it's a, a, a cart or whatever. But I was able to salvage, uh, 16 bearings, uh, from from that but anyway people were just using these bearings and just like cutting wood and making rails out of them and just like uh, getting aluminum from Home Depot and stuff like that but I just I discovered how can I do this for cheap and how can I you know maybe use these bearings for something else and I, I do actually have an idea for these bearings that are just gonna be um, better for a heavier application so, <clears throat> I discovered in Home Depot <laughs> these awesome little screen window kits. You know, I was like, I was looking at it and I was like, oh, it's, that's pretty heavy duty aluminum. Like, it's not, well, it's not heavy duty, but it's it's strong enough for what I need it for. And I was thinking like, yeah, well, maybe I can uh, I can make the, uh, the roller bearings just kind of go up and down the, the rails here. <coughs> but on Discovery... Uh, you can go even a lot more simpler and low tech, and I'll show you in a second. Let me just crack this open. I'm going to pause the video here. So, I cracked it open, and as you can see, these, these are the rails that, it, uh, that comes in the package. Anyway, if you look closely here, these little grooves here, these little jaws, I'm going to call them, um, there's this little rubber foam piece uh, like a little uh, they call it a spline and that you pull that out and you put the screen in and then you put the spline back over it and you have this roller wheel that goes right down here and it causes tension that makes the the screen window for for the outdoor windows or the out, outside windows so but I was noticing that on further review you can take these and I'll show you I'll just get out here. Obviously, these come out. That's the purpose of it. But oh, I'm just probably use this fo uh, this rubber foam spline for something else. Um, take this one out too. But yeah. And if you notice that these jaw-like grooves here, I was like looking at it further, but if you flip it over on kind of like on top of each other and perpendicular and put it right in the groove, it perfectly slides perpendicular to each other. And you can use this for so many different applications like you can see this self-made drill press I uh, I made um, has them, and I also, if you can see down here, I made a slide for it. So like when I'm doing detailed work, I can bring this close to me, do my work, and then push it back so I have more room, and it slides right along side of it. But I actually want to show you the current project I'm using it for. That it's fantastic. It's it's perfect. It's perfect for what I need it for. And these things were cheap. They were only like ten dollars from Home Depot. And you get like thirty six inches each, so it's like plenty of rail for for my projects here. And uh, also, it comes with these things. These uh, awesome little leaf springs. You know, leaf springs I can use for uh, for different projects where I need you know some kind of tension. 
but um, I'm obviously going to use those later for something else. Just wanted to let you know that <clears throat> I got all this wood for free from Home Depot. It was basically at the uh, the wood cutting area. I just uh, it was just scraps from uh, from contractors just needing uh, stuff cut, and I just said, "Hey, that's gonna be perfect for what I need it for," and it was all free. Just asked. They said, "Yeah, Merry Christmas. Have at it."